Are you looking for the best high chair for small spaces? We're in an RV right here and we have a seven month old baby. And so we needed a high chair for him to be able to eat at in the RV. And so I think we have found, my wife has found the perfect high chair for small places. And I'm gonna share with you guys what we have here. First of all, hi. Hi to all the new dads out there. This is Dad Reviews. This is where I give you my unedited, hopefully more authentic look at the products that we like, use, have, and my wife buys for our baby. So if you're interested in that, you might want to consider clicking that subscribe button. So like I said, we're in an RV here, and my wife uh, and I, we knew we needed to find a smaller high chair because the one that we brought on our last trip was just too big and bulky. And she found this thing called the Pop and Sit. I'm gonna link it up down in the description below. You guys can go and check it out, read other people's re reviews, but I'm pretty sure that it's good because it had like 3,000 reviews or something like that. It was up in the thousands of reviews, which is I always look for whenever I'm shopping on Amazon. So like I said, link down in the description if you guys wanna go read some of those. But let's take a look at what we have here. First thing that I noticed though about this, which was made me a little sketchy from the get-go, was the box. On the top here, it looks like the sides have been cut off and they just taped it over the top here. But on the other side, it looks all right. It looks pretty decent. So um, I'm curious to know if this was used or what. I don't know, I'm not too sure what we have going on here. So let's see what, what's in the box. Let me pull all this uh, tape off here. Okay. Oh, it comes in a nice little bag. That's always cool. That way, if you need to take it carry it, you know, if, if from the house to the RV or carry it around or whatever, you can do that. It's got a nice little handle on it. I like that. Ooh, is that a pocket on the outside? Uh, love bags with pockets on the outside. That's awesome right there. Ooh, there's something in there. This is made by Summer. It's got a little butterfly logo. Um, okay, cool. Yeah, but look, we got straps in there, little straps that have been wound up. Let's get to the creme de la creme here. Let's pull that drawstring. Guess this is more of an unbagging too. An unboxing and an unbagging. Man, this thing's tiny. I gotta say, I mean, we could easily sit this on the counter somewhere. And the other one we have is like this big, giant, massive thing. And this thing's just popping right over there in the corner. I'm liking this thing already. All right. Hello. Okay, okay. So it's like a, it's like one of those foldable camping chairs. There we go. If you guys go camping or if y'all are RVers or anything like that, uh, it's, it's like a, you know, those foldable camping chairs. Got another pocket on the back here. Gotta love that. Um, it's got but the safety buckles right up front here. They look pretty durable. This is the kind where you press the button in the middle and then pull it apart. Uh, one thing that I have to say about the buckles is that usually whenever you have these kind where you have to put, press it and pull, you usually have to have two hands. The other kind where you squeeze the sides, they usually just kind of pop right out as you squeeze, so you can do those more one-handed. So that's just one thing that I note uh, from the high chairs that we've used in the past. Now, here is the tray. It's about yay big. Uh, it's what, uh, two feet maybe, I'd say? Up to my elbow, hand, fingers to elbow. They got their little symbol, their little butterfly company logo right there. But the way this thing sits into the chair, it's pretty cool. Let's see. So they have these two nubs on the front here. And on the back of the tray, there are these two little guides right here. And then uh, this little metal piece right here goes in and out with pulling that right there. So this thing, line it up right there and right there my first time doing it it's always interesting <laughs> let's see oh i bet the fabric has to be taut enough so you got to make sure that you open this all the way to get it into there and then it's not as easy as a regular tray but Apparently, you know, you got to give a little to get a little, you know, that, that whole saying where you got to, you give and you take, give and you take. So you're giving up some, a little bit of convenience so that you can have the space. There we go. Got it. Boom. It's going to be secure in there. That's for sure. That tray is not falling out. Uh, that is in there. I'm pulling on it right now. Arrgh! And that thing ain't coming out. 
So that's awesome. Even like this, this is a small little tray thing. Uh, it'd be cool if there was like, I know they probably can't do this for safety reasons, but it'd be cool if there was like, if this was split in two and it was a hinge and you could fold it up with the tray still on there uh, just for storage. But even so, that over into the corner, just like that, is a heck of a lot better than a big old giant thing that we had. So this thing is pretty awesome. I, uh, oh, 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 rubberized feet too. Most of the other high chairs, the bigger ones, are made for, um, they, they, they're just like a plastic base on the bottom and they don't have rubberized ty uh, type of feet. So this will help with some non, you know, uh, so it doesn't slide, non-skid, non-skipping, whatever you want to call it. Um, so that's cool. And then also the straps that we saw at the beginning of the video, they are made so that they will fit around a chair. So if you wanted to prop the kid up on a chair or something like that, you can do that. Since we're gonna be using it in an RV, I don't think we'll be using those straps because ours is a, um, it's a booth style. So that's where he'll be sitting, unless maybe if we're outside in some other kind of chairs or somebody else has a sofa or something like that, I don't know. Uh, but this is a great little travel chair that you can take with you going to a friend's house, uh, you know, going camping, RVing, traveling, taking it on an airplane. I mean, it's that small. You could easily bring this somewhere. And it's all made of this fabric stuff. Um, it is screwed into here. So the fabric stuff is easy to clean, but it, it, since it's screwed into you'd have to undo the screws before you can pop it off to clean it. And I'm not too sure how easy it would be to get off of this. Actually, it looks like it may not be that bad. The hardest thing would just be the screw in the back here. But easy clean. It's like this nylon type stuff too. So things should just wipe off unless it gets stained on there. And you're only going to use it for about two to three years probably. So... Um, so just whenever you're done, you can give it away or, you know, if it gets really stained up, you know, get rid of it or whatever. Um, all in all, I really like the size of this thing. I like the non-skip pads. I think they got a great design going here. Love how it folds up and, you know, can confine it to a small space. If you guys, like I said, want to check this thing out, I'm going to link it up down in the description below. Go and read some of those other thousands of reviews on Amazon and see if it's the best chair for you, for your small space. I'd be curious to know down in the comments below what other high chairs that you guys have looked at uh, already for small spaces. If you guys are liking what we're doing here on Dad Reviews, make sure to click that subscribe button. Please share this video with a friend on Facebook. If they're looking for a high chair, maybe they have a new baby and they do lots of traveling, they might be interested in this. Uh, I'm going to put some more videos right there on the screen of some other baby products that I've reviewed here. I'd love it if you guys checked out some of those videos. Go ahead and click one of those. I'll see y'all in those videos. Thank you, dads, for watching. That thumbs up is always appreciated. Oh, I do contest every month on the channel if you guys want to participate. That's linked up down in the description below as well. And dad out.